Hi, Mr. Fitch. So there's a video going around where people put lemon juice and sparkling water onto a griddle and it cleans it. So what I did is I poured one, like about a half glass of sparkling water, and then I added lemon. As you can see, I have a griddle that is quite dirty. Uh, so I cut up some lemon and then I, you want to put about like a whole lemon into the sparkling water. Okay. So then put that in from there keep going it took a very long time to put this in but just stick with it um okay and then so now we turn our griddle on when we're ready and as you can see i check if the griddle is hot once it is hot we know i'm ready to go okay so we got our scraper and we pour the water onto the grill uh, as you can see their water starts to fizz up as the griddle is hot and it is bubbling and it is also carbonated water. Uh, there's steam coming off of it, which I noted the video. I accidentally got a seat on, but that does not matter at all. Okay, from there, you want to mix around the water. Um, and then as I'm videoing, you can see just how dirty the grill is even more. And yeah. Okay, so then after that, I after some time, I put some more lemon on because I thought it would need it as the acidity from the lemon helps break down the, the excess grease on the grill. Okay, I'm taking more videos of the bubbles here. Uh, and then as you can see, I start to scrape and move around the liquid so that I can get every part of the whole entire grill. From here, this is a before and after of the griddle and, and as you can see once i turn it off i go to scrape it and i can just see how the stuff is totally just coming off and i was shocked that it works this well so the reason why this actually works is because the lemon juice has so much acidity and the acidity in it will break and the water the excess water is immediately getting burnt off into nothing so it's just the pure acidity of it and acids which are polar molecules generally break down um, different kinds of greases because of how they link up together so thank you so much mr fitch have a good one